guys think about this? Um, I'm I, I'm going to say color me a little bit shocked that they would sign both. Now they have a lot of cap space, but this tells me that the Chiefs are really committed to to really building the uh, um, the core of this of this unit and lis- losing both those guys or even one of those guys without a real backup at this point is kind of devastating. Um, you know, we've got some unknowns, some recent draft picks, um, you know, by, by Veach this past year that can kind of fill in maybe down the road. But um, the fact that they've been, you know, putting Wanya Morris at guard, I kind of thought that, well, maybe, you know, they're not going to keep one of these guys. And then you got Joe Thune, who's going to make $28 million next year, which isn't going to happen. So I think if the if Brett Veach can pull that off, and these guys will take reasonable deals. Now, signing Humphrey is going to be a lot less expensive, but some of the guard money is approaching $100 million. And yeah. that's, listen, Trey Smith deserves it. He was a six round pick. He was day one starter. He came in and he just dominated the position. He plays hurt. Um, he he's clearly was a first round pick if it had not been for the heart. I think it was a heart condition, if I'm not yep. mistaken. And, uh, you know, we would have not had probably some of the success that we've had. So if, if Beach can sign those guys, you know, this was, this was going to be a tough draft year, a draft class to sign because you've also got Nick Bolton, you got Noah Gray, um, you know, you've got some uh, Buckner. Um, well, Buckner's up for be free agency at the end of this year. So, uh, but if they can sign those two guys and that tells me the chiefs are ultra committed to, uh, to keeping this thing going and, and, uh, if they can pull it off within the next month, as the athletic athletic reported, not, kudos to me. I think it would be a terrific move. I just, I'm not, I'm just I not agree. sure that money is. Yeah, you're right with you're there. right with Creed because the center market is at a much lower number, mm-hmm. and right. even he said it at the at the podium where you know he's he can play guard, but he really prefers to play center. Mm-hmm. And that's where he's at his best. And he's, you know, right now, probably, you know, one of the one top one or two in the league right now. And he's probably not two. So he's going to get top of the market. Like the right. other point is the guard market has exploded over the last year yeah. or so. You're Big seeing time. guys getting, you know, upwards of 20 million per year. So, you know, the Chiefs do have a decision to make. They they have drafted a couple of guys that are very versatile and Hunter Norzad and CJ Hansen. And like you said, if you can swing some guys, if they decide that they can always they're always going to play their best five, right? Best five mm-hmm. guys. So Wanye Morris, I don't think, you know, just by him taking some snaps at guard isn't like, OK, we're moving him to guard. I think it's primarily, hey, let's get these guys well rounded because there you go. If Tooney does leave, you know, that's going to be an open spot. And these other guys are rookies. Wanye's been there. So it, again, it all kind of works together. You want to bring Trey back. You got these, you've got other teams breaking the bank for wide, you know, multiple wide receivers they're paying. I think you know when the when you know the league is zigging and you zag, let's put let's put let's soak that money into the offensive line, protect the franchise back there, number fifteen, and we'll figure it out at wide receiver. Most definitely, most definitely, I definitely agree. But I think Creed should get his sign. I think Creed should be signed anyway, because like you said, as far as like the center market goes, it's not it's, it's like it, there, there there's not a lot of top centers in the NFL right now, like known centers, I, I would add, you know, when Kelsey left and he, it was, it was, it was Kelsey and Creed. So now I'm like, yeah, like to me, definitely sign Creed because to me, ain't no, and, and, and a lot of guys that can take that position. I can fill that void. You know what I'm saying? What Creed can do. So I'm just on board with Creed. Man. Uh-huh.